Well, we made it through the week. Um, as we go into the weekend, I want us to take um, in consideration what our next week will look like. With our new attitudes of appreciation and our new images of what we could be, if we surrender ourselves and humble ourselves before the Lord, lean into his strength um, and see all the little miracles that he does for us, he ended today uh, in a huge way for me. And whenever you see him at work, you can't be in awe. Like the orchestration that he did to make what he did happen today is can only be done by him. I mean, literally just amazing and and not to spread his word is literally a disservice to those that don't believe for you that don't believe in in Jesus um is our lord and savior and and died and rose um the analogy would be that if i if you had a pair of shoes and they were on sale for free and I didn't tell you about them, and you found out later that you could have had the best thing in life for free, and I didn't tell you, wouldn't you be mad? You've been bought and paid for. What you're worth, someone died for, so it wasn't free to him, but you don't have to pay anything. You're you're. Debt's already been paid in full. Um, and because of my love and my joy, um, it's because of self-discipline. It's because I am training to be a better Christian. I'm not trying because whenever you try, you fail. You try a diet, what happens? You fail. Whenever you try to go to the gym, you don't go. Um, whenever you're trying something... I'm going to say 50, 50, 50, it's not going to happen. And so whenever you train, you get stronger. And so I tell my patients, we're not training, we're not trying to get a diet. We're not trying a new thing. We are training for a better lifestyle. We're training to be stronger. We're training our bodies. We're training our minds. We're training our hearts to be stronger. And so self-discipline is a huge aspect um, into that. And so whenever you practice self-discipline, you are training whatever area that is to be stronger. And so I love self-discipline. I love training my muscles, my heart, my soul every day, because every day I'm going to be stronger than I was the day before. And so I train my, my muscles at the gym, I train my lungs outside running, and I train my soul by getting to read scripture every morning. And so I get to, to read his love story, the owner's manual to life, every day. So I'm training my ears to hear him. And that way, he doesn't have to yell at me, but it's through his small whispers. I have trained my ears and my eyes to see the miracles that he does every day. And I cannot stress that enough. And so as we, as we go into the weekend, I want us to have a mind shift focus. And our challenge is, are we going to train to be better? Are you going to simply keep trying? And see how many more times you fail. So let's pick up a book and let's train our souls to become better today than they were yesterday. Have a great day.